What is going on Rev Nation? It is your boy Rev Wicks here and today we are back with another review and today I want to be showcasing Kotal Khan, the action figure that came out and I also want to apologize about my little upload schedule. It's been uh, a little bit since I posted and I've just been really caught getting caught up on school and stuff. It's been really, really, really difficult for me, not gonna lie and I've just been trying to focus on my grades and stuff because it's been so tough for me, especially in high school. It's just like can't mess up a single bit or else your grades start to flop and i know it's crazy but i'm glad to be back and um glad to do another review for you guys and i recently just got this kotal khan on amazon i really love everything about this figure i mean he's not my favorite fighter in the game but man this dude is so so gorgeous looking i cannot wait to see what this thing looks like outside of the package here is the side of the box he looks really awesome and the back right here and without further ado guys let's open kotal khan so this is what Kotal Khan looks like outside of the package. And man, he is definitely one of my favorite figures they've made. And that's just my opinion. I like the sword and everything that he comes with. I just attached his little hair. It's not that bad. You just put it in the back of his head. And it's not too hard. I'm sorry, I'm filming with my phone while putting it on his head. So it's a little difficult. But you just got to push it in. It's not that hard, actually. And I'm probably going to have to yeah, keep it that way. And the sword, I thought it was hard at first, but you have to kind of just spread his arms out or like his little fingers or whatever and just put the little sword in the, actually it's huge. You got to put the sword into the hand and it's actually pretty simple. I looked at the back and I was like, how did they do it? And then I was like, wait, I think you can spread the fingers out. So you just, all you got to do is spread it out and then you put the sword in there and it'll clamp onto the hand. So, which is pretty nice. And here is a stand that always comes up with, which I really like. The thing that did disappoint me, though, I mean, I'm not talking about Kotal Khan, so kind of, I do apologize for going off subject, is that they made the Joker, which I kind of don't know why. I mean, don't get me wrong, he doesn't look like bad, but I just, because since he's a DLC, and like, also, there's been so many, you know, Joker action figures, I'd say, I just don't know, like, because I've heard that the Mortal Kombat things, they've had a wave going, and that they get expensive as time goes on. But, like, I just don't know why they would decide to make, I mean, the Joker and stuff. Like, I don't know. Because same for Spawn. But I do have Spawn anyway. So, it's okay. But, anyways, guys. I'm going to wrap up for today's video. If you guys really enjoyed, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe. It would mean a lot to me. But, you, gotta, you guys don't have to do it. But, if, if you all do it, it would mean a lot to me. I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Peace out, guys. Y'all have a good one. And, God bless. Peace.